Okay, you guys, you guys are not prepared for this vlog. There you go. What's up? So as you guys know, I left Utah in like at the end of summer. So now a lot of that has changed. Like I swear, everything just feels like way different. I feel like everything just shifted. I hated it. I didn't love it. It hasn't been the best thing to happen. I tried out for my high school basketball team. I went yesterday. Gotta stay positive even after sad things. Guys, she's gonna answer, I know it. Hold on. All right, come on, she's gonna answer, I know. Okay, it is 3.30, I just got back home from school, and I haven't really done much, I just like dropped off my backpack and stuff, but welcome to the vlog. I'm just grabbing an after school snack, because usually when I come home I just get a snack and then I'll go and like sit down and look at work and stuff that I have to do, but today's gonna be kind of like a busy day. I have a test that I need to do, I need to get ready for another trip that we're going on, which honestly, it's not really like another, well yeah, it is another trip, but. We're going down to Utah again. I feel like the last video that I filmed was like a Utah vlog of us going there. But we're going back, um, our parents, they're going down to Mexico for like this trip, like a work trip type thing. And Brock and I, we're just gonna be left home alone at the house. And instead my parents are like, okay, how about we'll do this? We'll have you guys go down to Utah so you can stay with Alyssa. And we kinda wanna see our friends too while we're down there. And so that's why we're doing that. So happy we're finally home. I have to get ready for that trip. I have to take this like after school, this test that I'm doing. It's for seminary, so if you know, you know. And then we have to film and take some pictures for for Instagram and for some ads that we're working with. I feel like November and December is like when we're working with like a bunch of ads just for like Christmas time, all that type of stuff. But I actually really like it and I'm so excited for all of the brands that we get to share on YouTube and then Instagram and then TikTok. We're gonna be sharing them all over on there. So we have some fun plans for that. Okay, well, brought back home from school. It's 3.32, and are you grabbing a snack and stuff? Yep, I just filled up my water. I try and drink just a ton of water after I get home from school because I swear I'm like dehydrated after. And then, also, I changed my clothes, so I'm wearing shorts and a t-shirt. Also, getting ready to go to the gym. And uh, yeah, I need to eat, and then I also need to do some homework stuff. Fun. Yeah, we both have a seminary test that we need to get done, and I'm just dreading it. It shouldn't be too it's bad. It shouldn't be bad. Boston's stressing about it. But tests are just. So Brock's gonna go and do that, get some work done, and then we also have some pictures and stuff we need to take. Oh yeah for Instagram. We'll take some pretty sweet Aggie pics. Okay, so I wanted to give you guys a little update on um, something that just barely happened, some pretty big event. Basically, I tried out for my high school basketball team. I went yesterday, I got running shoes for it. Well, this is kind of what happened. So these past few months, I've been really thinking about like playing basketball again and everything. And so I decided to try out, all I had was like my old like running shoes and stuff. So grab those. We bought a ball like two weeks ago because we, we didn't bring our basketball to this house. So I tried out yesterday. We did like drills and stuff and then they said that they'd let us know in 24 hours within the time of the tryout if we made it or not and basically haven't gotten any sort of contact back from them so pretty sure I got cut and uh, the other thing though too is that it was only a one day tryout which I thought was super weird because like usually they do like separate cuts but I guess this time they didn't I was also talking to my buddy and he was saying that he was just talking about um, the tryouts and everything that happened and so I'll read you guys some of what he said also when I went there yesterday there's all these kids there already in jerseys and stuff and they all, like they had just our school name on them and everything so pretty sure the teams were already picked just because of summer ball and there were summer tryouts before which I wasn't there for but but they said pretty much anyone who is a junior or senior who hasn't played years past at the high school probably wasn't gonna make it because people said their varsity is pretty good and which I'd be playing for junior varsity. But he also said, I heard like five people tell me how freaking fast you were and how insane you were at defense. Ha ha ha. So I'm like, dang, that's good to hear. I tried my hardest, but you guys, sometimes when you're trying out for something new or something that you have been playing for a while, you get kind of sad, but it's all right. It's just a learning curve and maybe I'll try harder for next year. Okay guys, to be positive about what happened, I did this about a year ago. I'm gonna carve a smiling face into my head because you know what? Gotta stay positive even after sad things.
All right, guys, I hope you guys stay more positive. Okay, low-key, that was super dumb of me because I'm actually seeing my girlfriend in like two days, and I know from the vlog and what videos you guys have been seeing, you guys have seen a lot of footage of me going back to Utah, and that is because, well, I'm, I'm actually going like in two days because it'll be like my one-month trip down there, which is actually pretty nice, so I'll be seeing her pretty quick because she was like just down here, but all right, first off, I need to start my laundry and get everything packed for that because I leave Friday morning, and then, um, yeah. Okay, so I'm about to log on to the computer. I'm gonna do my seminary test and hopefully I pass because if I don't, I don't know what I'll do. I'm gonna have to talk to my teacher about it to see if they have like retakes and stuff. But I heard this test like, shouldn't be too bad. I just always get stressed over tests for like no reason. Brock, I don't think he really does. He just kind of goes with the flow, so yeah. Wish me luck. Look at that score, 93%. I have 30 correct and two wrong. Brock, I got a 93, and you got what? 87. 87. Welcome to I got real grades. I got to be there. Oh, I'm, the smart, I'm the smarter twin. No, no, no. Okay, it has been like, I wanna say like an hour or two or like probably, I don't even know how long, but I officially have three of my tests done and I got 90% on each of them. So that's an A, A, and another A. And I'm so happy. After like taking my tests, I always feel like so much better. Just like beforehand, I always get like so anxious. Like, am I really gonna do this? Am I gonna be okay when I'm doing it? So, by the way, I don't know if you could hear that. That's, oh, I need the camera. You need the camera? Yeah. There you go. What's up? Okay, you guys, right now I am working out and I'm, that's basically what I'm doing right now. I'm using my rack and my bench and yeah, that's what I'm doing for today. Usually every day I try and work out right after school just so I can just get it out of the way and I can have like a bunch of free time for everything else just cause I like staying in schedule. But it kind of fell off cause it's 5.30 right now and my parents should be home soon. So kind of just doing a quick little workout, but let's do it. Okay, some of you guys wanted an update on our brand new kitty we got, Fancy. She's doing good, she's adjusting well to, I feel like, our family, so that's good. But she is just the funniest little cat. Like, every single morning I always come out here and I see her, she's just chilling out on the couch. This is usually where she stays, like right below the heaters and like right by the fire. She always just chills out over here. She's just so funny. Okay, so I'm gonna make some hot chocolate before I go to bed tonight. It's perk chill. It's like, it has like protein, collagen, and like all this other stuff, but I've been taking it, and it seriously is like the best thing if I'm ever trying to go to bed. Okay, you guys, it's been a while since I've talked to my girl, so here we go. She's gonna answer, I know it. Hold on. Still waiting, come on. All right, come on, she's gonna answer, I know. I know she will. <gasps> Kessley! Hi. <laughs> Hi. What's up? Okay, so I'm on FaceTime with Kessley. She was actually asleep when I FaceTimed her and stuff, so I woke up from her nap, which it's actually... It's actually 8.30, so she was just about to go to bed, like super early, but yeah. I wanted to hurry and talk about something for a quick second. Okay, so I remember what I was gonna say now. <laughs> there goes Kessley. Hold on, one second, guys. Okay, so basically, I was gonna talk about, oh, I'm gonna give you guys a quick little life update on just myself. So yeah, first off, let's start off with school. So I am actually, so I'm a junior right now. I'll be graduating next year, 2023. And for my plans, I don't really, I, don't, I wanna look back on this video and then like see my plans of what I'm gonna do. But right now I'm thinking I'm gonna go, I'm gonna graduate. And I actually might even try and graduate like, like I don't even know, a few months early, just so I can go get a head start and everything. And then like, if like, 
I don't even I don't even know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go through my my senior year. If I like it, great. If I don't, I might take some extra classes and do like some online stuff to graduate early. And then I think for a period of like January where I would graduate all the way up until like the end of summer, I'll do like a full on like last hurrah of being a um, teenager and stuff going into the adult world. So that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, another thing I'm gonna say and manifest is that I'm gonna be 6'3", 280 pounds. I guess we'll have to see and wait for that. But if I believe, it'll happen. All right, so for the next question, I'm gonna be getting into like the reality of moving away and leaving your friends and stuff. So I'll give you guys a little taste of what I think. So as you guys know, I left Utah in like at the end of summer. I have a really good buddy, his name's Parker. I also have a girlfriend, her name's Kesley. And then I also have like a bunch of other friends too down there. But those are basically the two main people that I used to hang out all the time with, other than family and like just random groups and stuff. But so now a lot of that has changed. Like I swear, everything just feels like way different. I still talk to Parker and stuff. I talk to Kessie like every day. And then I feel like everything just shifted a little bit from that. But we still talk every day and I'm gonna go down and I'm gonna go visit all of them super soon. So yeah, that'll be fun. But now being at a new school and stuff, like I was kind of alone at, in, in the beginning. I, like we have a few kids we know like Chase. You guys know who he is. He's been on our a few of our videos. We have the Mabry's Bow and Ava. And then just like church friends, school friends and stuff. So yeah, that's been good. I've been making a bunch of friends ever since school started. So yeah, if you guys ever want to meet them, uh, comment down below and maybe we can do a friend tag, show you guys all my friends and yeah, we'll do that. But so far, for right now, moving's been like, it hasn't been the best thing to happen, but it's like, it's slowly progressing. Like from the beginning of August when we moved here, I hated it, I didn't love it. But now I'm starting to like it even more and more. I think it'll be like weird to look back at this like from a year from now and see how much like everything's changed. So yeah, hopefully I do a recap video. Remind me guys to come back to this video and kind of do like a one year later thing, so. Okay, and this is the final thing I'm gonna say. This last message is always be positive. There you go, that's your sign. Okay, this Loki's kind of turned into like a night routine, sort of. So, finished up my laundry. Laundry basket is empty. I got all my clothes hung up, but I need to pack. I also need a shower. And then also I'm gonna go drink some Perk Chill because yesterday from my basketball tryouts, I was so sore and my legs are just dying right now. And also even parts of my back too are killing. And right here, the center of like my elbow kills. I don't know what it was. I think I went and I got elbowed right there and I think it's bruised or something because when I keep stretching my arm, Anyways, let's go make some perk chill. Okay, I'm showered, I'm ready for bed, but it's 9.15 and usually Boston's in bed right now, so let's go check in on him. Yeah. Here, open it. They scare you? No. Okay, well, what's up? Nothing, I'm just getting ready for bed. Are you already going to bed, like right now? Yes, I'm listening to an audiobook. What audiobook? Oh, nothing. <laughs> well, guys, this is Boston's life now. He actually listens and reads books now. No, I'm not. Which is a massive surprise. No. But that makes me. No, I was on. I was literally on TikTok for like the last couple of minutes. But I'm going of course to bed you were. All right. Well, good night. Good night. Is there anything you want to tell the camera before you go to bed? Um, I did really good on my test today. Better than probably my ACT. Good job. Okay, you guys, lights out. I'm going to bed. Okay, I'm actually really curious if you guys have any questions for me, so leave them down below. And also, if you guys have any ideas for what I should do in the future, like between that period of when I'm graduated and the whole summer, let me know what I should do, and uh, yeah. Okay, tomorrow is Thursday. I'm gonna pack up and stuff, and then I'm gonna go and head out to Utah. I'm so excited, I cannot wait. I got my outfit ready for tomorrow, and yeah, that's basically my night. It's kinda turned into a night routine, so sorry about that. But if there's any other videos too you guys wanna see, let me know. And yeah, I'll see you guys in our next video. Peace out.